Hi, this is Richard Green, the Civics Dean, with reason number eight to vote in the midterm elections on November 6th. And that is that you can transform your state on that day in the midterm elections. I bet you didn't know that midterms are way more important than presidential elections when it comes to your state. In fact, on November 6th, we are electing 36 of the 50 governors. In presidential elections, we only elect 11. And a governor is like the president of your state. He or she signs or vetoes every bill that your legislature passes for the next four years, including bills on a woman's right to have an abortion, whether your state has background checks or bans assault weapons, whether your state stands up to climate change and brings on more renewable energy, whether your state gets dark money out of your politics, and every other kind of bill. He or she will also sign or veto the bill splitting your state up into districts. Are they going to do it fairly or will they sign a bill that gerrymanders your state? Now, secondly, you also elect state legislators in all of these states as well. Are these legislators going to pass the bills that you want? Are they going to pass the National Popular Vote Interstate Compact, getting rid of the Electoral College? And lastly, in many states, you actually get to be the legislature yourself and pass bills, sometimes some really important ones, like ending animal cruelty on factory farms, a proposition in California, banning offshore oil drilling, a proposition in Florida, expanding the rights of victims of crime in Nevada, and so many more. Now, to see the complete list of every state proposition on the ballot in the midterms on November 6th, go to WTF, are the midterms.com and download my free book, WTF Are the Midterms.